Hello everyone, welcome to Manari TV. Um, baby, I I have to go get something. I forgot. Forgot where? Uh, there's something I need to buy for the family. Let me oh. just buy it somewhere here. Okay. But at least you should have just driven us in. You can't leave us here. Don't worry. Just you keep moving. Okay. Once the gate opens, just go in. Okay. Okay, just don't be long. I start going. Um, oh, come on, come on, baby. Daddy loves you. Daddy loves you. Don't stay long. You're gonna pull my hair. Okay. Be, be quick. Okay, I'm coming. All right. Sit down for please. Good evening. Good evening, ma. And I'm your AP. Um, I'm actually on my way to this house, but my husband went to get something, so I have to wait for him. Okay. But even at that, you can't just block the road like this. Okay, can I come in? This is the palace of a very, very powerful king. Ah. You understand that? Okay, can I come in there? Driving at once. Thank you. Gucci, what's going on? Um, my you don't allow them coming before you start throwing your questions at them. That's exactly what I'm doing. So go ahead and do Fairness. it. Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon. I'm so sorry about the way he behaved. He was just doing his job. Oh, okay. Yes. Please. Who, who are you and how may I help you? My name is Queen Esther Okaka, the Queen of Umudina Kingdom. Okay, who are you? My name is Rebecca and my husband is Prince Obina Okaka. And these are my kids. He actually went to get something down the road. He said he would be back and we decided to just come in ourselves. Your husband is who? Prince Obina. <laughs>
my daughter? Yes. Please, who are you? And who did you say is your husband? My name is Rebecca Achike, daughter of Mr. Godwin Achike, and um, these are my children. And my husband is Prince Obina Okaka. Um, excuse me, is, is Obina not who he says he is? I don't understand. My dear, Prince Obina came from this royal family. Oh. The mother and I and other members of the family are preparing to celebrate his 10-year memorial service. What? What? What I'm saying to you is that Obina died 10 years ago. That's not possible. That is not possible. How is it that I am married to a ghost? Obina drove me all the way from Lagos to the gate and he said he was going to buy something that he was going to be back. Rebecca, you need to calm yourself down. If you continue this way, you might hurt yourself. It's been more than two hours. You came back. Huh? Please calm yourself down. I cannot be calm! I am not married to a ghost! <laughs> You don't believe what my wife and my daughter here told you. Then let me tell you exactly what happened. Maybe that will help us a little to settle. Hey, 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 hey. please don't. Please. But, but I want to hear everything. I want to know. My friend, my friend, come give me. What is it? Are you standing there? Give me a weapon. What is Give happened there was not natural. It wasn't normal. It was an accident. No. Were you not there? I didn't see the king pull the trigger. That is why it's an accident. No. It has never been heard of. 
that a king of a kingdom killed his own prince. The heir apparent to his throne. Wait. Are you saying the prince is dead? No, no. Let's praise her life. Let's praise her life. In times like this, we need to be very strong. God knows the best. We did all we could, but the prince could not make it. Your Majesty! Yes! Your Majesty! Your Majesty! I mean, you are my friend and my brother. I mean, uh, nobody goes out of this gate without your knowledge. Tell me, where are my parents and my brother? Um, my princess, they all went to the hospital. Hospital? To do what? My princess, the king mistakenly shot the prince. I didn't mean my father mistakenly shot my brother. How? What happened? How did it happen? My princess, take it. It was, it was an accident. Accident. Please, please, my princess. You're just coming from a very far journey. Why not to rest a little bit? With time, you will understand everything. Please. No. Please, talk to me. It was, it was a mistake. Oh, God. I'm not getting this whole thing. What happened? My, talk to me. My princess, you need to calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Okay. okay. Which hospital? Which hospital did they go to? The family hospital. That's the, the general hospital. <laughs> We don't go there, wait, 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 wait. Yes, Your Majesty. He's fine. He's just in shock over what happened. What's going on here? Your brother will be now. Just calm down. He's not here now. He's not there. No, no. Someone should tell me it's a lie. Please. Please, Princess. Put yourself together. It's not good for the king, you know. So I think we've had enough for the day. I hope my husband is going to be fine. I assure you, Your Majesty, the king will be fine. Just that he tried to swallow everything as a man. But he'll be okay.
majesty. No, no. Where are the rest of the elders? And why I ask the three of you to stay and others to go is because you are my trusted ones. And I know you have been through thick and thin with me in this kingdom. Traditionally, I want to find out why I have to shoot and kill my own son. Somebody tell me why. How about a wine? As a wine. Okay, wine. As an adult barking, we defend our talo. Ada Baka Jebes Educa Moji Ojo Baleno Webia. I am here once again to seek your face as a wine. I did not come empty handed. I present this cooler note before your face to consult you. I have never and will never perform whatever due sacrifice that you demand from me. Please answer me. As and why, please answer me. As a way, I greet you. I greet you. You're welcome, my son. My son, what brought you from this part to me this hot afternoon? As a way, my king has lost his son. What must be done? You shall go to the thief at junction. And Ed is going to occur before you. Take it. Yes. And everything you seek shall be done as you desire. Go. Take the egg by your side. As a more, as I break this egg, every power you possess shall scatter. 
as this egg scatter on this two junction any power you serve any power that serves you shall scatter it shall scatter <laughs> As I'm gonna mess up, huh? As a more, this is for you. It can never come back to me. Huh? As I'm God. Oh, Tito de Legeso. Your Highness, all I'm seeing is a natural cause. Nobody programmed anything. It was just an accident. His mother, it's too hard for me to bear. But there's no amount of sweet words that can bring Obina back. <laughs> what do you want me to do? Just calm down. <laughs> what do you want me to say? To Just let me wake him up. Mother, please, come and wake him up for me. Wake him. You want your son to be with you. Wake him up. Wake him up. Please, let's lift our come. No, my heart is bleeding. My heart is bleeding now. I can't take it. I use no, no, you want to suppress me for me. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I don't want to leave you. No. Please, just try and calm yourself down. Oh, please. We all know he was close to you more than anyone in this palace. Please, let me go. Let me be in my father's shoe. What if you are his sister or mother? Please, it's okay. <laughs> Do you know you wish to pay for all that we are passing through in this palace every second? No, no, leave me. No. No. 
Ah! Ah! Ma, that's something that is bothering me since the cake is affected you, I, I don't know, to help him looking. Just of his son's death. And what might that be? Um, which one are the angel? Though I'm not in position for any throne. Mm. But the thing, thing that the art might have someone who wants to take over his throne. Um, Chief Funze, yeah. I told you this. There's a death number. That there's issues that are not supposed to be discussed in the open. Trees have ears. Walls have ears. So what? By the song we are listening to us. You know that I'm not going to take the throne. But all I'm saying is that sooner or later, all the cabinet chiefs will know what is going on. And they will feel bad about it. Let us be going home first. Eh? When we get home, we can discuss this in your house or in mine. Eh? This walls may have ears, like oh, your own wall or my own wall. Anybody can listen. That is not my own cup of tea. But all I'm saying is that that can never deprive me to say what I want to say. Anytime, anywhere. Mark it. Mm. Is it even possible for someone to be married to a ghost and bear children? My daughter, I have heard such stories severally. I never believed any. And this one? I found it very hard, but I believe this one. You believe it is not because he's your son? Yes. Because he has been appearing to me with those children, calling their names Frank and Princess, telling me they are his, that I should take care of them and look after them very well. My dear, have I not been telling you that? Yes, you have, Your Highness. But he didn't leave any clue. <laughs> he didn't leave any clue. We do everything together. We go to church together. <laughs> Rebecca, the spiritual controls the physical. Okay? Uh. Hello? <laughs> Where are you? Please, you come back. Just, just come back. I'm sure we can sort it out. That's what I'm saying now. Please come back. Obina, my son. Obina, my prince. No, he's not. He's still angry with me. He has not forgiven me. Yes, he has, Father. Let's say maybe he's trying to protect you from hurting yourself again. But I still want to hear his voice. Your Highness, can we please stop this? Enough of this! I mean, why do you make it look as if Obina traveled and he's back in his room and you people are hurting you with it? This is his place and it has to for crying out loud. You need to stop up with me, please. This is not happening. No. Rebecca. Please. Let's step off, please. Rebecca, you need to calm yourself down. Father, mother. Rebecca needs to rest now. Please. Please. I don't want to rest though. I'm fine. I just need you to tell me everything that has that happened. Rebecca, there is nothing else to tell you. He said that Obina was part and the beginning of the plan to take over the throne. That's all. No. My son wants her to know everything. That's why he brought her in this tent when we are preparing for his remembrance. My daughter. Our enemy was the least person we could ever suspect. <laughs> You then. Oh no. All I am asking is for you to lease half of your acres of land to me. Eh? 
I want to make use of that land next year for farming. Don't worry about the payment. I am going to pay you well. Very well. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Yes. Are you talking about my land at the uh, EC Dida? That is what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it that you don't always like to go to a place where we don't benefit? Why? You only like to go to a place where you win. You go here, you win. You go here, you win. What? <laughs> um, as you did, I have told you already. The land at Isindida is what I am asking of. Whoa. And when you <laughs> make reference about me going to places that profits me, you should understand that Onuru is a man that is created to win. You should know your know. I was not born to be counting trees and houses. No. I am made properly to live and live well, happily. Anyway, Um, can you afford to pay for the land? I know you are not lacking financially. You are not lacking the fin your financial capitalism is very balanced. But you know that land is very large and very, very fertile. Uh, you did. Initially, you were talking as if you don't like money. But now you've started speaking like a man that <laughs> loves the taste of money, just like you are know. <laughs> I, like I said earlier, I will pay you handsomely. Don't worry. Eh? Ego, you Oh no. I trust what you can do. I know you have the financial capability. I trust you. You know I'm not demanding for all, just half. Very, very sweet. <laughs> is it doing uh, along the farm road? Mm. Okay, it's always very sweet. You climb this, Mama. You climb up. I <laughs> mm -hmm. I have something to say. You see, we've been making a lot of money from Onowu this season. As the Onowu is interested in this is our land at Isinleda. <laughs> Why are you not saying anything? Hugo? Oh, you're not interested in what I said? The hmm. mama. The business is good. Just that the man that you are doing the business with is one we don't like. Why? Is it because of what happened in the past? Let us forget the past. This is strictly business. A father with you respect. We do not expect, Father, this can never be in the past. You sounded as if you have forgotten all that he did. This is a man who fought tooth and nail to ensure that you are not included in the king's capital. And not now. You are not. Father, I am old enough to recognize an evil man when I see one. Look, 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 look. It's okay, my son. It's okay. You see, um, why don't we learn to forget the past? Like I told you, it's strictly business. It's not in a friendly basis or anything we call it. Father, I bet we disagree with you. This can't be business. This just cannot be business. My husband. Our son is not lying. Oh, because they will pay you again. Has the characteristic of an evil man. <coughs> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. What are the stories for? I said what I said. 
Father, we are sorry you forgot to offend them. But why is it that my father cannot take a simple advice when he's giving? That's your father. Yes. As you just said, this man has the characteristics of an evil man. Oh no, he is a demon. That man is a demon. He knows this. Okay? Why can't your father understand this? Yeah! Hey. Mm -hmm. I can also this one have a Nine. Let me run along. And get the leaves from the bush as we requested. Ugo, why no? Please sit down. There is something I want to discuss with you. Okay. I have been experiencing some changes within me for some time now. What type of changes, my husband? The gods. I no longer hear from the gods. I no longer see what the gods are showing me. I don't have to do I don't I have been in darkness for some time now. My, what happened? Are you sure someone has not cast a spell on you? Spell? No one has the power to cast a spell on me. Throughout this kingdom, and even within our neighboring kingdoms, not even one person. Anyway, the last time I checked on the gods, I am still being favored by the gods, amongst all. What do we call this now? We are in a serious danger and open to any form of attack. No. No. Hi. No one dares it. I mean, no one can do it because no one knows. Oh, remember, I have been doing this since I'm doing with my own ideas and experiences. That is all. What if you make a mistake and someone finds out? Then you come again. Don't watch yourself. I am still the chief priest of this land. The Ojana Mo Ojana Mari of this land. The Anana Funi, the Anana Zuzu of this land. Yeah. Don't worry yourself. Very soon I will find out whoever is behind all this. Uh, may the gods forgive me because uh, if I get me, I, I just have to play with the gods in advance. May the gods forgive me for the evil I'm about to commit. Because if eventually I discover Whoever is behind all this, hey! The entire family is going to be wiped out. What's up? Hey. Hey. Nine. Okay. I'm coming. Let me go and get the leaves. Go. Go. Oh no. From the east to the to the south is two hundred and fifty feet. Why the north is about two hundred and some few feet? Then down this way to the west. Ugo, are you alright? Is that not your son? Please don't mind him. Maybe he's trapped. No, no. No, maybe he's trapped not get any meat today. <coughs> Please, let's forget about him. Mazudinu. Well, I've seen this place and I believe I, I like it. Um, this is the kind of things I love to invest money on 
Well, you asked for the money. Um, the money is available already. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know what you can do. <laughs> um, we have to go to my house so that you can have the money. But um, I want to ask, the documents covering this transaction between me and you, which both of us must endorse before I hand over the money to you, are they ready? No, don't you trust me? The documents are ready. Where do you the old, the ocean, they are just ready. <laughs> what we need to do is just go home and sign the dotted line. Uh -huh. And the line becomes yours after giving me the money. Let's <laughs> go. <laughs> Let us go. <laughs> ah. yeah. we you. Hmm? I trust what you can do. Okay. <laughs> Madonna, now that we are done with the burial of my son, I want you to move on with your life. This is the right time for you. No, you can't keep hanging on like that. You are a beautiful girl with a bright future. Mother, no. No. There is no bright future without the price. No. Listen, listen. I saw the three well-to-do and handsome men you showed me. I saw them at the burial. All I am asking you to do is to choose one out of them and move on with your life. Whatever has happened, has happened. And such is life. Tomorrow when you may leave here, Madonna, listen to me, please. Mother, please. I'm begging you. Please don't chase me away. Don't. Please. Anytime I come to this house and go to his room, I feel his presence around me and I feel more comfortable. Please, I'm begging you. I'll be fine. Don't chase me away. I'm begging you, please. Madonna, I'm not chasing you away. What you are doing right now is that you're causing more harm on yourself and it's not proper. What I am trying to do is what every good mother will do. Choose a man, settle down and live your life. <laughs> no, no. Listen, listen to me. Listen to me. <laughs> Wherever my son is, he will know that you meant well for him. And you will even hear his voice telling you to move on. <laughs> no, no, I can't. I can't. This thing is too much. I can't do it. No. You can. It's too much. No, you can. Listen to me. You can do it. <laughs> No, 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 no. Listen to me. I'm a mother. No, no, no. Please. All I'm asking you to do is to move on with your life. You can't keep doing this to yourself. No. No. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> please, please. I don't know you can do this. You can do this for yourself. It's for your own good. Okay. It's okay. It's okay.
Madonna's mother is a girl. Oh, is Madonna okay? You said they've not seen her since the last time she came here. Anyway. After I advised her to move on with her life, Amanda said she came to her room. Yes, father. I told her that mother's advice is the right thing she has to do. I even got food. We ate together. I escorted her out. Have they searched for her everywhere around here? And I'm sure that this was the last place she left. Her mother said she had a phone conversation with her. And she said she was tired. Even though she leave her alone. Go and call her mother, Amanda. Yes, mother. What are you doing here? And how did you find me here? I should be the one asking you that. What are you doing in this lonely place? Do you know what time it is now? You made your parents worried. We are all worried. We have been looking for you everywhere. Where is my phone? I can't find it. it all. It's at the palace. I miss him so much. I can't be at the place. But you know I came here. At least let me see him. If I can see him. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let's go. Okay? Yes. You need to let go. Really? It's okay, please. Stop crying. <laughs> Stop crying. It's okay. It's okay. Please. Let's go. Please. You know you're a very good man. I know. A very, very good man. But uh, if you allow me to advise you, 
You see, it will be good for you to allow the gods to take their own course and play everything by their own way. No, oh no, no. <laughs> you see, I understand your fear. But let me make it clear to you that when I become the king of our people, very soon, of which you know, my family is the rightful owner of that kingship. I shall retain you as the owner because you are also a very good man. <laughs> This is a handshake from Olo to you. Hmm? Very good. You see, I appreciate. Thanks for the compliment. You always appreciate. Me. Yes. I know. <laughs> you see, the the manner you spoke, I really don't think is right. Mm. Yes, it could mean well personally to you. But you see, our ego is still alive. <laughs> still sitting on the throne. <laughs> Except you are wishing him dead so soon. Or maybe you have other plans. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Mm. The language of our elders are the language of wisdom. You are correct. The God forbid. No one's blood is worth that throne. <sighs> I'm only talking for tomorrow. Mm. Not today. Now you are beginning to make sense. It is getting clearer to me now. Because uh, the manner you spoke, I have started watching you from the corner of my eyes already. <laughs> <laughs> no. The ghost forbid that I dream such dream. Uh, you see, even though if I don't become king, my son is still very young. He will be there. I am not in a hurry. I am never in a hurry. <laughs> As you rightly said, the words of the elders are words of wisdom. Exactly. You just made the same statement now. You've spoken as a wise man. Yes. So let's continue with our mm. drink. <laughs> Uh, 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 what is it? Are you... Uh, you want to leave? Uh, you see, I, I am headed to another place before getting home. Um, let me reserve some space, because I know there will be a lot to drink and eat over there. So well, let me not fill all the space in my stew. <laughs> you, you want to abandon your drink? No, I'm not abandoning it. I've taken the mouth in Onowo's house. Let me try the next door. There is a lot to drink and eat there. Ah, it's all right. I will see you all. Well, however, <laughs> uh, when it is my turn to entertain, you eat and take home. <laughs> <laughs> Let's wait for that uh -huh. day. <laughs> okay, let me run along.
What is it? 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 My father, hey, bring him up, bring him up, bring him up. Hey, but I don't do this for you now. Hey, but I don't do this for you. What did you eat? Hey, what did you drink? Mama! Hey, 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 Make sure the Igwe is aware. Mistakenly, Mazu Dame died in my house. <laughs> there is no way I would have denied not knowing what killed him because both of us ate and drank in my house. Eh? Chimubanya. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Eh? Indeed. I thank the gods that I did not go any further to pursue the matter that I had with him before. Everyone will say that I killed him so that he won't be a threat to my throne. Igwe, you are right. And uh, if we should look deeper, his son is still alive and vibrant. I think he is even the one that is a threat to the throne, Igwe. Oh no, huh? it will be too late before anyone will come to think about that. Ah. Yes. Oh well, I am sorry for their loss, though. Mm -hmm. I heard that... Uh, the son and Mazudenu's wife, that they are doing everything. They are going all out to find out the cause of Mazudenu's death. They better do it quickly. They have my total support. Okay? I will send another guard to go and disseminate the information. <laughs> oh no. Ibe, that's why we talk about you in this our <laughs> land. Eh? You oh no, we <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Igwe. 
Na ni bewo. Aha. Um How are you? I'm fine. Uh where to? The king sent me uh to deliver a message to Matthew this wife. Oh. You are heading to this family. Yes. No. Nah. Let me join you then. Let me join you. Okay. Let's go together. Okay. How is the king? Yeah, the king is doing very well. Okay. Yeah, hold that. Oh, hold up it. Hello. You're welcome, sir. Mm -hmm. Oh, my son and I are safe. Very safe. Um, do you go sent for him? The king? Yes. Yes. Yes, ma'am. The king said that your son will go should come to the palace later in the day. To come and collect the remaining money he promised to people. And they should also not delay to come to the palace with anything that you may need. Ah, I should come to the palace later in the day? Yes. Please thank him for us. Eh? Eh? Do our come. You heard him. Perfectly well, Baba. Mm. Um, both of you may be wondering why I came with him. I was on my way to the palace when I saw him coming here. So I decided to come with him. Eh? In as much as uh, it took both of you time to accept the gift I brought, I mean the foodstuffs and the money, but um, as soon as I leave here and I get home, you are going to hear from me again. <laughs> Thank you so much. Please. You are welcome, you are welcome. Just try and understand us. I do, I do. No, thank you very much. It's all right. Very much, thank you. It's all right. Such a kind man. Yes, yes. <laughs> so let's go on our way now. Okay. No. No. Okay, let me see. Uh, uh, don't bother. Just don't bother. No, no, let me see. You. Don't bother. We know our way out. <laughs> Take care of yourself. Okay. Eh? Take care of yourself. That should come to the fall after time. Yes, yes. <laughs> uh, So, what are your next plans after this? Hmm. My plan depends on what happened if he just died. Okay, good. I will advise you to go and fortify your son in case of any other thing. Why? My husband, the chief priest. Things that someone evil is after your family. Someone after my family? Over what? Stop acting like a child. Don't you know someone may hate you just for no reason? Someone may try to take you away just because of your happiness, your contentness in life, even your son that is doing well in business. You're making me scared. The mysterious death of your husband is only enough for you to know that someone evil is after your family. That is why I and my son wish to know what happened. My dear, wake up. They say prevention is better than cure. Save your only call before going out to inquire the reason of the other loss. And if you think the chief priest wants you to give him money, no, he want to do it free. So make us why the fight shine. So to tap on me. Because God the back. Oh? Oh my 
acabo A semana do laburo, é? themselves because they went in sight of power in order to overthrow the true to fear that abomination in the sight of the gods <laughs> chief priest why are you in a hurry to leave All of you, to the extent that I had to consult the gods five times on one issue. Well, if you people don't believe me anymore, your highness, you can send some of our cabinet chiefs to all this memory kingdom and then consult this small, small little doctor who I am very, very sure I'm great at that. Your majesty. I am worried. I wonder why the chief priest is talking to us in this manner. I don't know if you did notice. He is beginning to act strange lately. Listen, even if he's arrogant, not in this palace or in our presence, your Highness, if you will permit me, 
Let us travel to other kingdom and consult other children. Don't well, I get something different? <laughs> the chief priest is greater than them all. It's like leaving the elders to ask about our tradition in the hands of young men. With due respect, Your Majesty, there is sense in what you just said. There is no harm in trial. You can never tell. I don't just believe in this whole story. The shock has not left me. No. Who? Hmm, what is it? Imagine. Imagine the king and the cabinet chief turning me around like a child, asking me useless questions, questions upon questions upon questions, useless questions. But did you tell them what we discussed here? Why should I? Why should I tell them? When they were busy asking me questions upon questions, asking me questions, asking me to keep consulting the gods over and over and over concerning one thing, just one thing. What we are they asking? They were asking me of what went wrong with the Uday no family. That is all. Good. That is when you should drop the mini web. Did you? Hi, Nani. Hi. I, I couldn't. I, I couldn't remember anything. I couldn't remember anything. I, I, I decided to conclude the matter by telling them that the Udeno family were the people that actually brought death upon themselves because they went in search of power in order to overthrow the truth. Hey! I'm Who has done this to my husband? The eyes, the ear, the mouth of the ghost. My. Boy, how are you? Fine. You come closer. Come closer. Come closer. And how is your husband, the chief priest? He is fine. I know. I'm not talking about his health status. I'm talking about his relationship with the gods. How is he communicating with the gods? Oh no, you? You sounded as if you have become the chief priest. And the gods have told you that they are not in good terms with my husband. I only asked a simple question because your husband has started leaving trails of words that are questionable even to laymen like us. 
you know what I'm talking about. I will advise you talk with him and find out how he's faring. Yes, before it becomes late. <laughs> you better take to my advice. Talk with him. Find out his situation. It may get late. Oh no, you. My daughter, before I proceed, we will want you to tell us how you came about to be our son's wife. Okay, don't worry about tomorrow. Yeah, it will be concluded. It's okay. Hold on, I'll call you back. Good day, Gina. How are you? I thought I've warned you to stop calling me handsome. Please, if you like to get a cross order or an angry man to shut up anyone that calls you handsome. But you know what I'm doing? I was so glad to shout it and be shot dead with handsome in my mouth. Then you must be crazy. <laughs> Are you just trying to know? Come on, Elena. It is not your fault that you're handsome. You should always thank God for that. Anyway, I brought you something good for lunch. Um, thank you very much. You can now go to your office because someone might walk in here. No problem. I work for you anyway. Enjoy. Thank you. What is going on? What is wrong with women? I can't even concentrate to do my job. I wasn't talking to you. I heard you said something to me as a wife. Um, Joy, with my lips, I wasn't talking to you. You should have said, kiss my lips. That would have been better. <laughs> you seem to be thinking that you're in a wonderland. But I guess you wake up from your dream. Oh, mm. <laughs> you know, I would love to be in that kind of dream. Like, forever. I would want to work a couple. <laughs> hey, I have something nice for you. I mean, uh, thank you very much. So, can I do my job now? As you can see, I have a lot to do. Is that all you have to say? Oh, maybe I'll stand up and come and give you a hug. <laughs> or, better off. I pay you for the food you bought for me. Come on, Obina, don't insult me. What's that? I'm bigger than this. Just enjoy, okay? I love you, See you later. I think I better lock my door. I better lock. I better lock my door. Sorry, you get in. Wait, That's it. No, no, you did. I decided to bring this food because I feel you might be hungry. Oh, as usual. Yeah, as usual. I'll be in my office.
<laughs> oh God. Yes, come on in. Man, what's up? What up? Man, I'm good. I don't have to make a bed Not really a bed Bazaar. I call it bazaar. <laughs> what is really going on? I, I, I don't know. Man, come on, sit down. I think I'm having bazaar here. What is going on? As you can see. So why are you doing justice today? You are the master of food, so you can go on and start having them. And what exactly are these things coming from? Then you can find them. When I look at the shape of the food, I will know who is who. This must be Jim. Because you are in trouble, man. You are in trouble. Aha! Uh -huh. This is John. Because I know the shape of step food. You know what it comes with? Food bag. Wait, 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 wait. Let me ask you. Why are you looking, why are you looking your lips and swallowing it? It is only, it is only a stupid man that will not lick his lips when he sees food. <laughs> but come to think of it. If you don't want to eat, I can do justice to you. I know it easy. So, what I heard about you and women is true. What you heard about me and women? Okay, sorry. Let me rephrase. What I heard about how women from live around you is true. Fair enough. How do you cope with all this drama and you're able to concentrate on work? I don't know, but I just thank God, you know, my work is important. I focus on my work. My work, very important. Never mind. So, how is that? Um, so, Amani, who's this new guy in the office? Every girl seems to be frolicking around. Hmm. Obina. Huh? A very hard working young man. A young man with precision. Uh -huh. A young man with accuracy. In fact, if you take your time properly, you will have to stay with that young man. And he's handsome, if I may ask. 
You already have his picture. No, 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 no. I've just done a background check on him. It's just that I don't have much to work with and I was hoping that she would give me that information. A background check on him? I don't really get it. Why is it that everybody come to me with this rhetoric question? I call it rhetoric because I don't even know how to answer it. I don't really know. Is there anything you are really trying to dig out? Uh, no, no, not much. I just wanted to know more. A little bit more about But it's fine. <laughs> Thank you for the drink. If you are here to drink, make use of that table. Why? You don't want us to share a table, but you want us to share one man. What's the matter with that baby girl? Sorry, my dear. I am here to drink and enjoy myself. I would love to talk about a man. <laughs> okay? And frankly, I am here to see you so we can talk about him. What do you want? <laughs> Excuse me. Hold on. You don't ask me what I want like he's your man. For what I know, not even Steph has had a kiss from him. Mm. Yes. So what's your point? Well, my point. I think it can actually work for us if we can agree. Hmm? For us? Yes. <laughs> Sorry, dear. There is nothing like us in this game. Please, Joy. Let me land. Okay? No, no, no. no. Keep flying. <laughs> Fly. Well, girlfriend, haven't it occurred to you that the same man we are after is giving more time, attention, and affection to Steph? You know, if we can work together, knock off Steph, we stand a chance of having him to ourselves. <laughs> Sorry, my dear colleague. I said it before, mm. and I'm saying it again. There is nothing like us in this game. Okay. All ladies in their own league. <laughs> you see what I was telling you? It's the way she carries herself. Because Obina gives her more affection. That is why we have to work together and make sure she's out of it forever. Come on, Joy. It is not so much. We have to do something about this. We really have to work together. yourself with alcohol. It won't help you. Let us take her out.
What is going on? The dog. This is not the six. I was I was very shocked when you called me and said you're still in the office working. Yeah. By this six o'clock, a human being created by God. Bros, you are going to break down if you don't take time. Pack all these things, let us go. Dr. Manny, I am not going to break down. And I will never break down. Okay? And after all, it's not that late. You are giving me this impression that you are something else. Mm -hmm. Having no accuracy, precision and calculation in everything you do, I am beginning to wonder that something is wrong somewhere. You better pack these things, let us go. Mm. Let, let, go. let us go. Okay, okay, okay. You win. Okay? Mm. But just give me a little time. Let me round up on two things. And, you know. So that you can pack this workload to the house? <laughs> no, I will not allow that. Let us go. Please. Let us go. You know one thing? I just... I just love working. Just love it. A man hates working. You are the only one that loves working. I never said so. You lazy man. I never said so. Nah. Boss. <laughs> boss, boss, let's go. I work, I work, I work. <sighs> let's go. Back, back. Are you not packing my files for me? Uh, if I don't pack it now, nah, probably it will break down one day. I need to pack my files for uh, me. Let me pack up tomorrow. Before <laughs> uh, joy and audio. Um, Dr. Money, uh, please, right now the network is very bad. But I want you to believe me that tomorrow I must definitely transfer the money to you. Yeah, sure. I, I believe you. You know, everything you do is all about being perfect. Definitely, I'm going to see the light in the morning. Okay. Thank you for trusting me. Uh, no, no problem. It's, it's nothing. All right. Um, I need to, I need to make a shift. I have a presentation, a kind of lecture, a kind of small thing to. I want to deliver. No, no, don't, don't tell me you're leaving. I'll see you. Okay, bro. You uh, take care. All right. See you. Yeah, see. Steve, what is it? What is it? Stop this. Okay? Please. What, what do you mean? Are you not a man? Come on. Don't tell me that you don't have feelings for a woman. See, I I do, okay. But what you want me to do, I I, I cannot. Ozi, Ozi, Ozi. Steve, Steve, come on, come on, come on, stop, 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 stop. Okay, 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 okay. Listen, Steph, join your plot, okay? See, listen to me. Listen to me. Steph, come on. Don't do this, please. Mm -hmm. See, I, I, I want to tell you. Listen, just listen, okay? I like you. You're beautiful. You're awesome. You're highly endowed. Anyone that sees you this one, and they can fall for you. That man is crazy. But, but what do you want me to do? I cannot. Okay? Please, please, put yourself together. Obi, why are you hurting me? What have I done? Obi, am I not sexy? Am I not good looking? Uh, I'm, I'm Steph, listen, you're, you're highly sexy. You're beautiful. You're like lollipop. You're licky, licky, licky. But... Let the truth be told. Just put yourself together and and get over this. Okay? 
please. something, baby girl. Girls, you won't believe what happened. Could you believe that he totally refused me and even threatened to throw me out of the house when I tried to seduce him? <laughs> why? Is it nothing to me, man? No. <laughs> I hope it's not what I'm thinking. What are you thinking? Like, is he a homosexual? Oh, God forbid. Why do you do anything like that? Because I don't understand why any man on earth would refuse beautiful ladies like us. I don't get it. Well, you know, I've actually monitored his moves for like a month plus. You know, he has a girl out there or something. Mm -hmm. And I found no. As a matter of fact, the only friend in this town happens to be a man. Are, hmm. Are you saying that Amani is a biosexual? Please. Not at least. Come on, I know Amani is very good in bed. Hmm? What? Oh, please, Joy. She think I don't know about her affairs with him. Uh, no, 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 no. I am not denying the fact that I had an affair with Amani. But I'm actually surprised at you. I remember you said something like, I will never and never have an affair with a colleague or a co worker. Yes, I said that. Not when you kept on pressing with great gifts and all that stuff. It's like, girl, I remember the first start of that eager guy I was dating. Oh, yes. Enough, girls. Enough. Please. Let's go back to the topic that brought us here. Are you trying to say that Obi and Amani are bisexual? I don't, I don't get it. I just hope it's not what you think and mm -hmm. what you say. Uh, Dr. Amani, the truth is that I, I don't like what you did that day. You made me look like a fool. But I've, I've asked you for forgiveness many times, time without number. I don't know why you are still repeating this issue. What I did for you that day is not something bad. I don't have any bad intention towards it. I did it for you so that you could have somebody who could take care of you, especially after work. But the way you are sounding me, it seems to see if I've, I've committed, even like that. that. I'm, I'm so sorry, once again. Not that. Just that I choose to live my life and how I like to live it. It is alright. Once again, I, I apologize. I apologize. I press so. Thank you. Oh. Hi. Hi. Please do sit. Welcome. How are you? I'm good. I see you're doing very well. Let's go. Little wonder why my father gave you such position of authority in so short a time. You seem to have won the hearts of everyone around here. It's good. Unlike the other one who occupied that position and started acting like he was God. And started acting like he owned the company. Um, men are born of women. Born men. But created differently with different gifts. I need someone to take me out this weekend. Um, I am very, very... Yes, I'm very busy this week. I have a lot of things to clean up. And then I have like um, two weddings to attend to. Then um, meet up with one or two things. Really? Because I haven't even mentioned your name and you're so quick to turn me down.
You know, since I will be taking over my father's position in this company, I think that you're the best person to put me through on how things work around here. So you don't have a choice, sir. You are going to take me out this weekend. You have not really decided on who to go with. The moment you decide on any of them, others will just back off. That's the problem you're having. Just my, take my advice. If it is Gina, I believe Steph is much closer. Steph is somebody I know a little bit. She's homely. She can make a good wife. Just go on with her. I don't know why you are wasting time. You know what? Thank you. Vina, sometimes uh, you make me sick. I'm yet to understand all this whole scenario. Thank you, Mr. Advisor. No God bless you. Thank you. They will keep on disturbing you. They will be disturbing you. This one will come. This one will come. But the moment they see that this one has really taken place and this one has really settled that with you, all of, all, all, other ones will just back up. I say thank you now. I'm just trying to address uh, what I said now. Uh, probably you will consider and reconsider what I said. It's all right. You don't need to worry about that. I'm happy for you. But see, Amani, please. I need you to work out something for me. Just tell me what to do so I can win his heart. Please, do it for me. Well, whatever is your proposition, uh, definitely is going to be a very hard tax. It's not going to be easy for me to begin to talk to Obina about you. Uh, Obina is a man that believes in accuracy. He's a man that believes that a thing should be done the way it's supposed to be. It's not a man you can force to do something. I don't know how to go about this. Come on, Amani. Not when a fat envelope is involved for you. You don't insult me with that kind of demand. If there is anything you want me to do for you, you can spoon in yourself properly and let me find a way to help you, not bringing up the envelope. It's okay. I will call you now last time. I have something for you. That's okay. No problem. All right. All right. All right,
What is this call? You almost made it to knock somebody down. What is the problem? What is it? Is it a kind of insult or what? Even if there is any problem, why don't you cool down for me to probably we settle down? This kind of call, I don't like it. Insult you? Why you are the one insulting my intelligence? I get the attacks to do. Why don't you tell me that Odi is going out with our, 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 our boss's daughter? Uh, what's the name? What's the name? What's the name? Uh, 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 Rebecca. Why don't you tell me that? What is your problem? Are you high? Are you joking? Are you joking? Is it? Is it? Is it marijuana? Is it? Come on, please, please, don't give me that look. Stop it. Why are you behaving as if you don't know? You don't know? Even if I know, would heaven fall? Is it a big problem? Why don't you allow these people to settle down? Even if they want to settle down, allow me to do the whole thing for you. Why are you? I don't, I don't understand you. What is the problem? You don't know. You don't know. Then swear to that. Swear you don't know. Amani. Why would I swear? A complete woman to swear before a woman is it not heresy? Is it not stupidity? For me to swear before you, John, whether they are going out or not, does it look mature? Does it look reasonable? Amani, please stop giving me that salmon. Do the work I asked you to do, or you return my money back. How much, Please. Are, how much are we even talking about? What is wrong with you ladies? What is the problem? Impatient? You people don't even have one patient. You can't even say, allow me to do this work. I am on this. I am planning very well so that you can have this young man. I don't know why you're so in the haste. What is wrong with you girls? Just do the work. I will do it. Why don't you give me time? Can I do it? I am on need. I don't know why you are running your mouth, opening your eyes so wide as if we are quarreling. Do the work. That is what I want. Hey, good thing you have to go there. Let me do this work. If people see, if people see you shouting, it seems as if you gave me a work to become a president of Nigeria. Calm down. Oh. You're welcome to my humble home. This is beautiful. You have good taste. Thank you. Do you live alone? Um, this is how I've been living. Okay. I'm sorry. sorry. <laughs> and um, what do I offer you? Um, water would be fine. And you give soft, pain. No, Thank you. Okay, I'll be right back. Huh? Startled me. You really need to be scared because I don't understand. What are you doing? What do you mean? What am I doing? I'm killing it. Because I don't believe that people from inflation homes like you can do this kind of thing you're doing now. Amani, what do you take me for? Well, I don't know what you mean by that, but where I'm coming from, we actually suffered. We started from the grass. Okay? So, I don't think there's anything wrong with it. And I'm surprised why you have that look on your face. A beautiful lady from a wealthy home, maybe from Donald Trump. Is it possible for them to come to a home like this to begin to dust? That's why I'm surprised. That's why I sattled you. I am here to believe myself. You shouldn't be so surprised. Did you ever wonder why my father left me in charge of all his companies in Nigeria? Now I can believe Well, that. that's because my brothers think doing stuff like that is suffering. And I enjoy it. I am here to believe this. You have something in No, oh, my food. That's just uncomfortable.
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't even ask me to talk to this guy. I never know you have a wonderful cook. A woman from home. I'm telling you honestly, this is very delicious. In fact, every afternoon I'll be coming here. There's actually more where that came from, so if you need more, I can arrange it. Look at my plate. Almost finished. Just take another one and go. I'll tackle this one. You have food, eh? Mmm. Mmm, oh God. God gave me a wonderful wife. Wait, mm. wait, 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 wait. That meat is too big, honey. Bring that meat. We have some height. <laughs> we have it, bros. Enjoy, enjoy. Even the chicken. God gave me a wonderful wife. Mm. Hey, baby. I'm going to do. I'll tell my friends. The kind of view we have for people from Richmond, they should change it. Oh, can you just stop it? Even when I came here, I was surprised when she was dusting, cleaning everything. I was saying, ah, is it possible? Welcome, Amani. So, what is the good news? First, let me have you... Let me give you your money. What? Take your money first. Please. Okay. Thank you for taking your money. Second is, I cannot hurt my friend. He wants to settle down. understand. What, what do you mean by that? Definitely, I know you will not understand. Obina and Rebecca are trying to settle down. They want to be a family. And I will advise you to stay out of their life. God. And another thing I would want you to do for me is this. Try as much as possible to pass the information out there that they want to settle down. It's going to be a good thing for you. And it's better you put off all these shenanigans, all these problems you have. In fact, I will go I see you, honey. Thank you. One thing. Which? Joy, come on. Why are you in like this? What is it? You want to know why? Opi, do you want to know why? Yes, I want to know. Because you are evil. Because you are wicked. Because you are heartless. Opi, because you are a gold digger. And because you are going to miss the test of me. Yes? Yeah. Ask your friend Amani, and he will tell you better. Jesus. Oh, mind you, this is not over yet. One way or the other. Not today, not today, please. Over what? And why is Joy living like you had a fight with her? You should have asked her. Does he look like a quarter? Anyway, I came to congratulate you over your choice. 
And the truth is that you made the right choice. Thank you. You're welcome. Yeah. I've told my parents and they're very happy. Okay. Especially my dad. He says that he'll come see us whenever his chance. Wow. Thank God. But there's a problem. He's asking about your family. Where you're from. And what was your answer? I told him that your family is fine. What? Why did you lie? What if they find out? They are not going to find out. Before then, we will probably have come up with something. I did not like to lie. Not in this situation. What did you expect me to tell him? I mean, how would you feel if a child comes to and says, Oh, Dad, I want to marry him, but he doesn't know his parents, he doesn't know his family, he doesn't know where he's from. He grew up on the streets. Would this sound okay to you? Maybe you should have told him that I was adopted. Just like I told you the truth and you believed me. That's what I'm saying. It's not going to go down well with him. So, what do we do now? Because I don't want to lose you. Maybe you're not going to lose me and I don't want to lose you too. So don't worry, I'm sure we'll be able to work something out. You know, she's been sending me her pictures, but I think I like this one more. So beautiful, yeah. this. It says something else, man. Uh, the game is something else, man. I can just stop, you know. What is like your preparation? What are you... Oh, boy, now you didn't ask me this kind of thing. I don't really know because, you know, sometimes when I look at you, I see you from the physical point of view, I see you from the spiritual aspect of... Did you ask her to come? Um, just calm down. Calm down. Why? Calm down, Obina. Just calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Just calm down. I, I asked her to come. And it's for the reason. Why don't you allow her to sit down at least properly? Maybe I can make proper introduction. There was something we discussed. I told you I'm about settling down. I told you I need to be a man. I told you I need to be a responsible man. I told you I need to be a father. I told you I need to be a man in which you see children running in my house. I told you I need a mother. And this is the mother. The mother of my children. I'm going to work. Um, Amani. Yeah, I'll be mad. This is the biggest surprise of the millennium. Tell oh, me you're yes. not joking. Oh, yes. I cannot joke. In fact, you know me to be a man that does not joke with things of responsibility. Okay, 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 hold on, hold on. You see? Okay. This is wonderful. This is nice. This is I can I can't believe it. You need to believe it. Is that your life? I wish Rebecca is here. Anyway, this calls for celebration. Let me get more drink. I'm coming. Okay, no problem. Come on, sit down. Bravo. He said you were coming from a street before hours. Then some masked men 
came out from nowhere and attacked her. What? They all fell down, as if not something knocked them down. Then, they escaped. Chai! Thank God, that's very brave of you. This is the second time that I am getting attacked. Ever since we announced our second time. Have you, have you made an entry? Yes, I did. The first time it happened, I did, and now... I said, I'm just so scared. Somebody somewhere is not happy. Honestly. We're going to fish out this idiot. This fool. And deal with the person. Joy. Why are you panicking? I thought you have the heart of stone. Okay. You frightened me? How did you get into my car? It doesn't matter. I am here to warn you seriously. Stop what you are doing. Else, find your dead body car in the street. I don't, I, don't, I don't understand. What, what are you talking about? Rebecca. Rebecca is what I am talking about. If anything happens to her, I will disgrace you to the world and litter your dead body in the street. Be warned. My parents actually went to see your parents today. What did you say? <clears throat> well, I knew of a couple in the town where I did my NYSE. They didn't have kids, and that was very nice to them. In fact, I'm actually building a bungalow for them. And I got them to act as your parents, and they did not object. Why would you do that? Honey, I don't want any stumbling block. Not now, when I've just survived two assassination attempts. All thanks to God, I just don't want any more stress on this. Well, I will go and see them myself. Okay, I'll take you there. I called it strange love, but I didn't know that more was yet to come. It was a divine arrangement. The other guests would have run off. I thank the God of heaven and earth for today, for he has wiped away my long, teary eyes. <laughs> my daughter, welcome once again. Thank because you. you are coming from a very far journey. Indeed. I don't think I can do this, mother. <laughs> she did it because she was chosen for it. Just like our blessed mother Mary was chosen. Great. 
And we are grateful for this. Please, it just came to my mind. All these words should not leave these words because we are yet to conquer our own enemy. It's again faster. Biscuits. All right, Mama. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can see you guys are having a nice time. Uh, Where is Frank? Ah, uh, he's asleep. Princess, how are you? Fine. Grandma is calling. She got something for you. Okay. Good. Careful. Mm. <laughs> mm. Can you please tell me what's transpired between you and Obi now? That was his mind. Do you see? Oh, mommy's back. How are you? How are you? Hi, <sighs> nice, sweetie. Hi. Princess Frank, can I go to your room and watch your cartoon? Okay? Say yes, daddy. In what is it? My parents. My parents are beginning to ask questions. They are beginning to ask questions about your family and where you're from. And the next thing now, you fall ill. Because that's what you seem to do every time someone asks about your family or where you're from. Especially since someone even recognizes that you're from Umudena. You see, that's why I never wanted to lie in the first place. The family we used as our parents has long traveled as agreed but we agreed that you would go and look for your people go to umudina my children are growing up they go to school they have friends they talk and these children will talk about their grandparents and, and, and their villages and these children will still start asking questions hey baby No problem. This time, I will go to Umodena to make a virus. You make so many promises. I hope you keep to this one. Besides, I don't want my parents going to find out before you do. They might go themselves or even send someone. I know them. It's okay. Huh? It's okay. So, was that why you didn't give me a hug when you came in? No, no, you don't even understand. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. I don't know how long I'm going to go about this. I'm in a deep mess. Is this how good is Kabumbo? I must have to tell you the truth. You should be thanking God for at least giving you somebody whom I believe that has awakened the consciousness in you to begin to find where you come from. And then the best thing you should do is to go to this village per se and then begin to make some inquiries on how to, how to get who your parents are by dealing with the kings and the elders to, at least they will give you enough information. And what if you won't be an What if... No, 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 no. You don't even need to think about that. I'm going to make out time so that we'll go to the village and do a proper search. See, um, Dr. Mani, this is my cross. And I won't bother you. I'm going to carry it myself, okay? I don't want to stress you about it. What are friends for? If, if I decide to help you out to do what I'm supposed to do as your brother, it's not bad, but 
If you think it's proper for you to go to the village and ask questions alone, I don't have any problem with that. I'm only trying to offer a help as a friend and also a brother. I wish you self journey. You know, with everything Obina and I went through, all I went through to marry him, I expected him at least to have mentioned it, told me somehow, anyhow. <laughs> that is not possible. You wouldn't have stayed even a minute if he had told you everything. Oh, that's true. I don't know how to tell my parents this story. I mean, who's going to believe me? It is not believable, but believable. That is the whole truth. Hmm? It's okay. Hmm? It's okay. Everything will be fine. Your Highness, there is um, something I've been meaning to ask you. I know that every kingdom has a king and a queen and the prince or princess or both and cabinet members but since i came i haven't noticed the presence of any cabinet member so i was wondering does this village have at all <laughs> thank you very much my daughter i do have cabinet chiefs like i told you the other time but when you come to find out that those your trusted chiefs are the ones behind all your trouble what do you do? You stay away from them, especially when your life is at stake. You answered wisely. After five years of my son's demise, that was when I come to know the intentions of my cabinet chiefs. I want to know if our gathering here is for the same purpose. Or are you supporting someone because it is the tradition? <clears throat> um, Your Majesty, as you rightly said, according to the tradition, that when a sitting king fails to produce heir apparent to the throne after five years, that the king honorably steps down from the throne and the kingship shifts to the next family that is qualified. Um, we all know right here that the five years have elapsed. But um, the cabinet deems it fit that uh, Your Majesty, you should continue so that... Um, oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Your Majesty. How many times did I call you? Three times, Your Majesty. You better stop faking it up. 
by calling me your highness when you have already ruled me out as your king when you look me in the eyes and call me by my name stating tradition your highness oh no remind me if i decide to step down now as the king of this kingdom which family is the next in line for the kingship i'm asking you which family or no with due respect, Your Majesty, it should be late Mazu Denu's family. Mm. But in their absence, which family takes over? Your Highness, in the absence of Mazudenu's family, which other family will succeed us? Oh, no, whose family? Oh, no wonder you raised that issue. My most trusted, the last person I expected to raise that issue. But at the death of my son, I knew that something like that would come up. But I never knew it would happen this fast. Can't you fight it? <laughs> fight it, you say? No. It is the tradition. Tradition, my foot. Your Highness, you can do something. I mean, it is your veto powers. You can do something, you can change the tradition. Can't you? It is not as easy as you think, my friend. And the so called Ono and the elders must have to come to an agreement for such a thing to take place. Um, okay. So supposing you convince four of your chiefs to come to your side, we can do something. I know exactly where you're driving at, my friend. But you have to think about the other dangers. The type of danger that can bring this kingdom down to its knees. I don't care. A man should have thought of that before raising such an important issue. He should have thought of that. That was how I stopped them from coming to the palace till further notice. You did the right thing. There's no point having people around that you cannot trust. But then again, how do you manage the affairs of this kingdom without them? I sent my messages to them through my guards. Some of the elders have even come to settle the matter, but it yielded no fruit. And now it's 10 years after my son's death. No one knows what they are up to. It doesn't matter what they are up to. God has blessed you with grandchildren, a boy and a girl. And I have pictures to prove that they are your children. Absolutely. Thank you very much. Wait a minute. Are you not the wife of the chief priest? Yes, Your Majesty. What happened? You are looking so unkempt. How is the chief priest? It's not been easy, Your Majesty. Everybody abandoned my husband and I in this hard time. But that wasn't what we heard. We, we heard his fast recovery. So, what are you talking about? Fast recovery? Yes. Wish you can follow me home to see how fast he is recovering, Your Majesty. Okay, let's go.
Is how fast the light to you he is fast recovering, Your Majesty. Wait, you mean he smells like that and you still stay with him? What do I do? Run away like others? No, Your Majesty. I, I, I had the best of my life with him. In this hard time, he needs me by his side. He smells like that because I have not gotten the medicine I use in cleaning and apply on the wound because of money. And what is that wound? It is called air poison. He breathed it in. In the process of healing it, it came out that way. My goodness. Yes. Are you aware the king doesn't even know of his condition? I mean, several times he has sent messages to the chiefs and they will come back and tell him that he's okay. Especially that, that wicked and evil or no. That stupid man. Um, don't worry. Hmm? From now on, we will take care of his treatment, okay? As soon as I get to the palace, I'll give some money to the guys to come and give you so that you can buy his medicine. Stop smelling. All right. Thank you very much, Your Majesty. My regards to the king. It's okay. And my regards to you. Okay. Mm. to have seen the chief priest with your two eyes. He is just a living dead man. The other day was too much. Hmm. Oh woman. Have the guards taken the money? I hope they have taken the money. I'm sure they should be there by now. I am seeing this whole thing from a different angle. What if Ono is still the same person responsible for this in order to take off the mind of the chief priest from the palace? Very possible. But don't worry. I'm sure very soon his sins will find him out. Your Highness, my Queen, good afternoon. I came to inform you that I will be going home tomorrow to see my parents. You know, since this whole thing happened, I haven't spoken with them. I've been keeping them in the loop. Oh, if you feel like this is the right time to speak with them, fine. Uh, if they want to come down, no problem. But if they want us to come over, don't hesitate to let us know. Okay. Are you living with the children? Um, no, but I'll be going with the princess. Thank you.
Yes, I sent for you. I want to thank you so much for all the kindness you've been extending to me, you and the care. Mm. Particularly the money you've been sending to me. The money actually helped to heal me. As if that was not enough, I went as far as sending more money and full stop. <laughs> Thank you so much. Hmm. You're welcome. Well, I hope you're getting better. Oh, yes. As you can see, I am getting better. How's it good, you all? <laughs> <laughs> If I had uh, all this money, all this while, I would have, I would have been healed. I would have been okay. <laughs> well, we uh, thank God for His provisions. Hmm? Thank you, thank you. Uh, another thing, of course, the main reason of sending for you, my queen. I want to let you into a deep secret. And also tell you of a very serious mistake I made in my life, which I am not proud of. We all make mistakes. In one way or the other, we all make mistakes. Eh? My queen, this is not like that. This one is that I did the worst by dining with the devil himself. Really? The very person you've been moving up and down with in an attempt to seek solution to the situation. How? Ono is responsible for my condition today. Ono? How? Ono traveled as far as the Seventh River to seek the oldest witch. Abara. Oh no, who inflicted this poison on me? Hey! That I will slowly die without Hey! Why would he do a thing like that to you? Why? You see, the thing is that he trapped me with Abara's child. Eh? And was in control of everything. He took some years to execute his plans. He also masterminded the death of Udenu and family. And he came forward to stand at the forefront in the king's position. Wait a minute. Are you sure Ono who did not mastermind the plot for my husband to kill his own son? Are you sure of that? Your Highness, I think someone is coming to us. Almighty Chief Priest. As a more as a more, how are you faring? I hope you are getting better. Are you now dumb? Why Is your husband getting worse or is he getting better? I can't understand. Both of you can't talk. What you told Delaney Jesus? What you told Delaney Jesus? Mm -hmm. 
Oh, Queen. Don't mind here. The day shall come. Your Highness, we need to do something urgently about to know. He's the devil himself. My Queen, you and I know that Ono can never sit on this throne. The gods of our land can never permit that. Thanks to Rebecca for my two grandchildren. Now my happiness and joy is back in full. Whatever they are planning, now it's like an exercise in fertility. Mm -hmm. Your I'm so happy that you know that you know who can never sit on this throne. Because by the time he knows we are one step ahead of him, we are done for. He won't hesitate to do away with us. That devilish man. My queen, you have spoken very well. I'm not going to do anything. All these years, the gods have been fighting their battle themselves. Let them continue. Oh, you see that you've been living in grace all these years? Hmm? Rebecca, welcome. Thank you, Mom. Where is Princess? My queen, let's go inside first. Your Highness, my parents didn't believe any word I said. So they asked Amani here, Obi's best friend and uh, his right-hand man at the office, to come down with me and see and hear things for himself. So my son, with the evidence that you have, what else do you want to say? Your Highness, I have nothing much to say, except the fact that the picture we have out there and the one I saw in this palace as the same as Obi now. But what I do not understand is the lady beside him. Oh, that's uh, Madonna. The lady Obina was supposed to get married to before he died. It's okay. With the evidences available to me, I believe I can convince my boss to come down and see you. Uh, but you know that my parents will still send other people to come and confirm. That will be better, Father. The years and everything is perfect. We don't have anything to hide. My son, once more you are welcome. Thank you, Your Highness. I'm sorry we have to know under the circumstance. But make yourself comfortable. You're welcome, sir. Thank you. Oh no, I greet you. Thank you. Is that not the son of man? My others. Greetings to you. Oh, greetings, young man. Your face don't seem familiar. Well, actually, I'm not from this kingdom. God, I thought as much. I am actually looking for the palace. I lost my way. Prince Obinna, who happens to be the son of the king, is my friend. We used to have our play day in university. So I, I came to see him. I don't know my way around. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. You're welcome to our land. Thank you. I am the new of this land. Beautiful. And he is there. Uh, Imagine 
the young man you were talking about is our prince. But it is a pity he is late now. Yes, he died in the hands of his father. His wicked father, who happens to be our king, killed him right inside the palace. And for that, the gods have decided to strip that kingship from him. The family is already cast. Where you are heading to right now is regarded as an evil place. It is evil in the eyes of man and in the eyes of our creator. Yes. As a man of my personality, as a man like me, a red cap chief, and an elder, I cannot watch you step into evil. It's not right. I can't do such. So I am advising you to quickly turn back where you are coming from. Because where you are going, sorry my son, you may not come out from there alive. Now you have your breath, you are still lucky. Entering that palace, meeting that wicked, bloodthirsty king. Oh, I pity you. What he will do to you? I don't know. That's why I'm advising you as a truthful elder from this land that you know to go back. By right, by now, based on what the king has done, I am supposed to be the king. Because traditionally, I have been made so. I am the next in line. And him, supposed to be my traditional family. But his wickedness, his attitude, and everything he does, everybody in this community has gone out and left him with his attitude. We are only waiting with folded hands, waiting for nature to take its right course. If you insist, that you want to go to the palace. On your way going, you may meet other reasonable red captives. They will still tell you what I have said to you right now. But if you fail to follow what I have just said, you go back. Unfortunately, I am on my way to somewhere that is very, very important. If not, I would have said, let me take you down so that you can meet all the red cap chiefs and they will tell you exactly what I have said. Where you are heading to is evil. <laughs> Thank you, Nobu. I must have to tell you, I am very, very happy. I really appreciate your lecture. It's, it's, a, really, it's a really good one. And I don't know how to find my way to the highway because I'll be going back to it. But Nobu, why? Is he one of the red chiefs? Mm. He is not because you can see he is not wearing a red cap like him, but he is just one of the men in this land. There are differences. Yes, he's a titled man, but the man standing over there is not a titled man. Okay. <laughs> but I am the new, the supposed king. <laughs> My son, you can follow this road to the highway, understand me? Don't divert to any other road. Just walk straight, you get the highway. I really appreciate it. Okay. Thank you, sir. Uh, have Thank a safe trip on your way. Thank you, sir. Mm -hmm. Bye bye. You have expressed this young man there in the right direction. That is sending all these unnecessary things to him. How do you mean? He needs to know more. I don't want to leave all our secrets to him. Have you forgotten what we are going through? Listen. You need to understand that I am doing everything possible for our own good. I am not done preparing. By the time I complete my preparation, <laughs> you see the king and his wife, they will not only run out of this land, but they will come begging that we should have our right. Oh, no. What is rightfully ours? <laughs> 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 you are wonderful.
Yes, but you can believe it. You can believe it. I'm not cool. It's an abandon. Yes. <laughs> Your Highness, with the way Ono who spoke, he, he is going to stop at nothing until he becomes the king of this kingdom. I have told him that time to die, but he is not going to listen to me. You know what? The truth remains that I really don't know where to start. Because I believe I did not come on this throne on my own. It was by the gods. And they have been fighting their battle. Father, in as much as we have seen several results that the gods are with us, there are still major roles we have to take as humans. <laughs> Let me tell you all one thing. Any day you start to handle your affairs on your own, the God that created you will lead you to carry on. Rebecca, thank God your father now I believe the whole story. What happened? I had a background check with the elders. And few information I got from few individuals around. Pass it to your father. And I compare them with the ones he has. He assured me that he would come in to see the king and the queen by next week. Fugo um, wine. Yeah, my nice, nice. Something is really bothering me. And it's giving me sleepless nights. Your husband that is supposed to fight her this evening is even dying himself. But I think the ghost is getting better. But why I believe you may know when we can get a stronger chief priest that will fight whatever charm. Oh no, we got from Abara. Your Majesty, I expected someone to come around to ask this question long time ago, but not from you. I mean, what do you expect? When the men are short of words, when they are scared of war, I mean, it's time we women, I mean, women like us, profound solution and take the bull by the horns. We don't have an option. We don't. You speak like your mind is made up for anything, Your Majesty. Of course. Um, okay. A young woman arose with a natural power to destroy evil. But wicked ones laid allegation on her. Chase her away. She is in the evil forest. Let's go and see her now. Let's go. Just like that? No. We will have to fortify ourselves because it is two days journey in the forest. Your Majesty, it is not a kind of journey you can embark on. Go on. For myself, and my family, and the kingship, and the entire people of Omodena Kingdom, I am ready to go if you go with me. Listen, let me tell you. If I perish in the process of getting a good result, let me perish, but I will get a good result. I will. Go on. You didn't understand when I said I am fully recovered. I can now see and I can hear from the gods a little. The gods are now favoring me. May the gods be praised. Good. Both of you won't just be standing there and watching me. Hold on.
this should have been my journey. But you can see, I don't have the strength. Let us go to the shrine and I will fortify you. We have no time. <laughs> Follow me. Don't follow me. Please. Footwears somewhere here. Drop your footwears. Oh, 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 Father, you sent for me. Yes, I did. Did your mother tell you where she was going? The guards said they saw her live with two bags. Uh, yes, she did. Where did she go? 
Where? Father, they have gone to seek for a solution over what Uno is doing. They? Who did she go with? The chief priest's wife. What is going on here? Eh? How come you know all of this? And I know nothing about it. Father, you have to wait until she returns in four days. What is going on in my palace? Eh? Has everybody gone mad? Even you, Amanda. How could you allow your mother to embark on such a dangerous journey? I thought you came back from your youth service to give us comfort and peace of mind. Father, she made me swear never to tell you until she's far gone in the forest. If anything should happen to my wife, you will get to pay you what you can get. Father! And I will never forgive you. Now leave my presence. Leave my presence! Something is not just right. Any problem? <sighs> oh, my God, bro. I am getting, I am not comfortable with it. I have gone to the shrine. I cannot even get entrance. But it's happening to my powers. Something blocked me to enter the palace. Something blocked me to enter the shrine while the chief priest is there, but he is not supposed to be there. How am I comfort? It's not more about what we wear. How am I? The sun gives light, and the 
day while the moon is out for the night. Put serves the same function. No matter how secretive a woman could be, no matter how, once she conceives, whatever that is in that pregnancy will be brought to open by the time she gives birth. How about am I? I want to know what is happening. This can't be. This is possible. Really? Was I blind? How can How about am I? As am I. This can't be happening. Comfort. How about am I comfort? How about am I comfort? I call on you. Comfort. This can't be happening. No. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hi. Let's rest for a while, oh. Okay? And continue with our journey. Maybe. Okay. Nico. Hi. I never knew you have strength going this far. Without complaining. Hey. your power. I am operating. King William. King William. So you sent your wife to humiliate me. The last time you saw her face, Shall be the last time you will see that face again. King William, I commanded you to kill your son. I am commanding you now. Go and kill yourself by yourself. Hey, I'll, I'll go see him. Finish your
Oh no! I did not see you again! What happened? What's the problem? I didn't see you again! Why not? 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 I said never. What can never be? What can never be? Why did you sell your soul to buy evil? Why? As a more, what did you get in the Men like you are stumbling blocks. You are blocking my way, as a more. You are blocking my way. It is you who is a stumbling block to yourself by selling your soul. And by an evil. Why did you deviate? Why did you derail from the good you've been doing in this land? Why? Only one word. A normal word that you would have allowed into your heart. You remember? Do you remember or no? Oh, 
Ono u. Ono u. That's Mazi Udenu. Ah, you are looking very good today. Really? <laughs> yes, looking very good. Thank you so much. Ah. <laughs> Ono u. Hmm? It seems to have a big celebration in the palace. I'm not really Mazi Udenu. I am actually on my way to the neighboring village for a traditional wedding. Oh, oh, oh. But I will still go to the palace <laughs> when I return later in the day. Oh, I see. <laughs> Jiseke, oh. Thank you. Um, God will actually reward you for all the good work you have been doing in this kingdom. Amen. Because you are working like the king. Mm. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, Yes. I thank you so much for the praises. Thank but you. I have to be on my way. Because from what you are saying and what I am seeing, if I continue to stand here, <laughs> all the praises that you should render to our king, I might eat all of them standing here. <laughs> so let me be going. Eh? Okay, you see But it's so delicious. Mm. <laughs> yes. Oh. Yeah, good <laughs> but am I really walking by the way? That means they are seeing me to be the king. And that means I can be the king. <laughs> that sounds nice. I can be the king. If I can walk on like the way, then I can be the king. <laughs> that was how you sold your soul and bought evil. And today, you shall be returned to water. Mm. Mm. I see a dead man speaking. Ezemo, how dare you? Ezemo, how dare you challenge my power? No, no, sisiya, no, aromba. Return to the palace and save your husband with the powder you have. Make sure.